What up, fam? What up, what up? Here, let me turn this around real quick. Try to do that, uh, try to do that because, uh, uh for those of you guys who are just popping on, you have no clue what I'm talking about, but trying to do that because it's the screen image. Just a quick little periscope, go, dude, I can't even talk today. Quick little periscope tip is whatever the screen sees first is going to be your like screenshot thumbnail image on social media. So it's been a while since I've seen you guys. I think, I don't think I've been on periscope for maybe a week now and, uh, there's a reason for it. And let me just explain something really quick before I give you this top leadership characteristic that I was just thinking of as I just got done swimming. I'm actually on the way to the Apple store right now uh, to exchange a monitor or get it fixed because my monitor is jacked up. So I just went ahead and bought a new one so it'd be a little bit quicker. Because um, you can't have you can't be down when you're an online entrepreneur. Uh, somebody says, I'm, you miss me, I appreciate that. Make sure you guys are tapping the screen, tapping the heart so I know you guys are alive and uh, in action. But uh, real quick, swipe up or swipe right depending on what device you are on and share this on Twitter and share this with your followers because this is gonna be a great tip. This is one of those things when you can embody this characteristic, I promise you it's gonna change your life, all right? It's absolutely going to change your life. So real quick, swipe up if you're on Android, share this on Twitter, share it with your followers. Swipe right if you're on iPhone, share this on Twitter, share it with your followers. And uh, I'm telling you, this is gonna be a great tip for you guys really quick. but. Appreciate you guys so much. Uh, thank you, Ol Olivara, for inviting your followers. Shift, appreciate that. MV, appreciate Pammy. Sue, appreciate that. Shift, again, invited followers. Alina, appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate the shares. Okay, so here's the top leadership characteristic that you need to embody or embrace or start to acquire if you want to ever be successful as an entrepreneur. And make sure you guys keep tapping the screen. I want to make sure you guys are alive because if you don't tap the screen, then my heart's not pumping either. You know what I'm saying? So we got to all be pumping the hearts together. Um, but here's the, here's the deal. At the end of the day, the top leadership characteristic that I was just thinking about as I was swimming, and by the way, if you guys don't swim every single uh, week, I recommend you do that. Swimming laps for some reason brings out the best thoughts and best ideas I've ever had in my life. But here's the thing I was thinking about you guys, okay? What you guys need to start embodying and embracing as a leader or a future leader or even as an entrepreneur in general, you need to start embracing being confident, okay? So many of you guys are not confident and that's why you're not winning, okay? You can do all the best things in the world, you can do all the right proper steps, but when you're not confident and convicted in what you're doing, everyone around you can feel that and your results will be either non-existent or they will be non-lasting. Okay, they won't last very long because confidence breeds confidence. And that's why so many people join me in my business is because I'm super confident and I know if you enjoy, or I'm sorry, I know if you um, join our team, you are going to win, okay? I'm just confident in that because I know how many people that I've you know, literally brought from nothing to you know, having an amazing lifestyle on the internet. And so it's just like, I'm confident. But how do you get confidence when you don't have results when you don't have team members that are crushing it when you don't have you know the uh, income claim you could say right or even uh, you know your leadership to be able to ride off the base of that well confidence really comes from wisdom and it comes from action so the first thing you got to do to have confidence is you got to start learning you got to embrace being a student you got to embrace really working hard at you know, sitting there behind the knowledge and ingesting it, <laughs> digesting it, whatever you want to call it, but bringing it into your life, okay? I was the best student on planet Earth when I first started my businesses, seven years ago, when I had no results, when I made no money, when I literally had no students, when I had nothing, people rode off of my confidence because I was learning things that I knew that worked, okay? So right now, you're learning things. If you're on my team, if you're following me, if you're at vincentortegajr.com and you are plugged in and watching and reading my emails, you are learning every single day things that work. And they're proven, and they've been proven for seven years, okay? So when you are sharing the things that you are learning from me, you can be completely confident that it works. And if you don't have confidence, then you need to realize right now, right here today, that you need to remove that doubt and you need to remove the fact of the matter that you can't do something, okay? Or it might work, okay? Because every single thing I ever tell you works. Because why? Because it's proven over seven freaking years, 
okay? So you literally, what you do is you learn the stuff that I'm teaching you, you borrow my confidence, and you go out there and share it to the world, and you be confident in what you're doing. Now, here's the deal. When you start following what I'm doing, right, because a lot of you guys are seeing, you know, th these crazy numbers, these crazy results, you know, I've made almost $180,000 net income in the last, like, 37 days, and everybody's like, oh my God, I, I can do that too, right, because you're so confident. No, see, look, it took me seven years to really make my network thrive, okay? La I would say within the first three or four years, it was just all right, okay? But the last three and a half years or so, it's been crazy, all right? But you can still borrow my confidence and know that if you work hard and you stay diligent and you do what I say over time, you're gonna have my results, okay? And so let me block this loser really quick. And so what I want you guys to realize is that you have to start borrowing my confidence. You have to start borrowing your leader's confidence. You got to start borrowing whoever in your company is crushing it. You got to borrow their confidence. You got to go out there and share with the world because, hey, it's proven if it's proven if it's proven. If it's been done before and it's been done several times and it's been done literally thousands of times, it's proven. So there's no reason to not be confident that you can't do it. The only reason that you aren't confident is because you haven't become a good enough student. You haven't learned. Okay, you haven't absolutely stayed, you know, in the course. Okay, you go to school for, you know, what, 12 years, 15 years, 20 years, and you get a degree to go be average, but you're confident that your degree is going to get you a job. And nowadays, it really, you know, you can't be even confident in that. But a lot of you guys will just do, you know, formal education. And then your self-education afterwards is just becomes kind of like, oh, I'll throw 50 bucks into that or 100 bucks into that or 200 bucks into that. When you've thrown tens of thousands of dollars into college and a student education and the, the money where it's really yet, if you don't want to be average, is the money that you spend after college. The money that you spend after you get your, edu your formal education, okay? And I think Jim Rohn, he said, formal education will make you a living, self-education will make you a fortune and so you know it's just the truth you know and so a lot of you guys are going through life you know trying to you know learn things on the internet going to YouTube University which is awesome and just learning all these free methods and all you're doing is you know wasting your time you know if you really want to succeed you need to start investing in yourself I mean I would bet you my self-education my systems my growth you know minimum you know, several hundred thousand dollars a year over the last few years that I've put into to self-education, into systems and solutions and services that I knew that, you know, I needed for my community so you guys didn't have to spend that much, you know? Because when you guys work with me, you guys hardly have to spend anything in comparison to what I have to spend and you can still have the same kinds of results. And so it's just crazy. What I want you guys to realize is that when you're rocking in a business, if you don't have confidence, you're dead in the water, okay? And that's really the message of today. And how do you borrow that confidence is you learn from the people who've done what you want, right? And you absolutely steal and take their confidence because it's been done before. And if it's been done thousands of times, then you can do it too. It's just the fact of the matter is you haven't put in enough time and enough effort in yourself and you probably haven't put in enough money either, okay? So don't expect to spend, you know, 50 bucks, 100 bucks on a system or a program and become rich tomorrow, okay? You, you gotta start investing in yourself okay you got to start really putting some deep money into it okay and so you know when I really started breaking through you know I was spending literally tens of thousands of dollars you know in, even in a month you know when I was literally hardly making that much money you know I was making like twenty thirty thousand dollars a month but I was almost spending all of it so I could grow even bigger you know uh, but when I started with nothing you know I put myself into debt to get into a five thousand dollar program to essentially become you know where I am today we're living a lifestyle of complete freedom and so nowadays it's just crazy man I mean you can spend about five grand and you can really set yourself up for a multi-million dollar business and it's just mind-blowing to me you know because back if you want a multi-million dollar business this day and age you're gonna have to buy normally a brick and mortar type of building spend tens of millions of dollars um, get investors you know lose all your money you know for four five six seven eight years and then finally turn a profit later maybe 
And uh, now with the internet, you can spend about you know five thousand bucks. You know, you can have a multi-million dollar business set up, ready to rock and roll. It's crazy. I mean, you can even start with like fifty bucks. But like I'm telling you, you want lifestyle money, you want life-changing income, you want to be able to literally. Right now, it's like middle of the day. You know, I'm just out here doing what I want to do, and you know, at the end of the day, I could just basically decide what I want to do every single day, all day, because I made an investment in myself. I made a decision that. I wasn't gonna be average. I made a decision that college education wasn't the only money I was ever gonna spend. And I made a decision that I was never, ever, ever gonna be average. Ever. Because average doesn't leave legacy. Average doesn't make impact, you know? And so, hey, some people wanna be average and that's cool because without average, you know, mentalities, without people doing average jobs, man, we'd be screwed, you know? It's like, so, because if I'm going to the Apple store right now, if there wasn't people working in the Apple store, I'd be screwed. I need the Apple store to be open. You know what I'm saying? And so I'm just saying, guys, like you have to realize, hey, if it's in you to go and stretch and strive for excellence, do it. Okay? Do it. It's in you, man. I'm telling you guys, for real. Absolutely do it. And I'm not saying Apple workers' lives don't matter. Who said that? Who said that? Nobody needs to say that. I'm telling you that if it's in you to be a little bit, you know, bold, to be a little bit, you know, better than the person next to you, okay, then you're you're going to be there. You're going to be successful. I'm telling you. It doesn't take much, you know. It doesn't take much because at the end of the day, average people, you know, they just went through the average lifestyle. All you got to do is just do a little bit more if you want to be successful, a little bit more and put yourself in the position to win. And until you start investing in yourself, spending some solid, good money, right? Do what you gotta do, put it on a credit card. That's how I started. And then go out there and just take action, man, and follow people that have what you want. We gotta get rid of whoever this is. I don't even know what's going on right here. Um, weirdos. But I'm telling you, man, <laughs> you, can, you can go through life, give as much love as you want, all right? But the reality is it's all about investing in yourself. You got to borrow confidence. You got to rock and roll with it. And you got to go out there and you got to share it with the world. But until you, if you really don't have confidence, then you got to start being a better student. You got to start investing in yourself more. And that's what we all have to do to become successful. All right. So if you're feeling me, if you're loving this message, heart it out, heart it out, heart it out, heart it out. The high fives are pretty much the hearts these days. And um, I'm going around this car, sorry. And uh, make sure you swipe up if you're on Android. Share this on your Twitter. Invite your followers. Um, swipe right if you're on iPhone. Invite this with your, uh, invite, invite your Twitter, invite your followers. And uh, let them know, man. Let them know the message, man. Let them know they need to start investing in themselves. Let them know that if they want to be better, that formal education is not going to get them to the places that they want to go. I promise you that. It's all about self, education, borrowing confidence, going out there, and just freaking making it happen, family. Much love. Appreciate you guys so much. We'll talk to you very soon.